Well, it's a good thing UCLA won this game. These people are happy for the fireworks that also commemorate Yogi Roth's upcoming birthday. <laughs> happy 25th, Yogi. Yeah, I appreciate uh, that. <laughs> good job. All right, well, this one uh, wasn't as one-sided as that score would show, although Josh Rosen did get 42 up there for UCLA. Yeah, a much improved game from a week ago for Josh Rosen. I thought his ability to have full field reads, climb the pocket, he had great protection by his offensive line and running backs, put his body on the line, even picked up a block. For Soso Jamabo on an incredible touchdown run. This team's still evolving at the wide receiver position, but they're trying to find some weapons offensively. If they can remain healthy, I think this team behind number three is about to do some special things. And defensively, a couple of DBs and big nights for the Bruins. Oh, no doubt. I mean, Randall Goldforth, his first career two interception game, he was all over the field. Fabian Moreau was awesome, locking down one of the top receivers in the country, Devontae Boyd. And that group, as a, as a secondary, as a unit, they played their most complete game potentially under Jim Moore, I think, when they go back and look at that film. Yeah, Josh Rosen passes for 270, and UNLV's premier receiver, Devontae Boyd, did not catch a pass in the second half, the shutdown play of Fabian Moreau. Well, there was definitely a recipe for success in the second half. UCLA found that, shut down the best player, got a victory. It's on to Provo. Big matchup against BYU in a week. Yeah, no kidding. Well, Bruins, Chris, in the 2016 season in the Rose Bowl, winning their home opener for the sixth consecutive year. Three rush touchdowns for Soso Jamabo and UCLA scores two fourth quarter touchdowns to prevent any drama on opening night.